Hi kids, how are you today? Look at this beautiful scenery. Are you ready to draw and paint it with me? Fantastic! Right, we're going to start by drawing the sun. It's easy, just a circle with some rays. Now some curvy lines for hills and a rainbow in between two of them. Let's do a tree. How about some fruit in the tree? Just some little circles. A boat. And a house with a triangle roof, a rectangle door, a chimney, and some tiles. Some windows. Let's add in a river, some grass, and there you have it. We're ready to paint. Yellow sun blue sky. You can of course use crayons, colouring pens, pencils or paint, whatever you prefer. It's going to be a beautiful scene. Ok, let's go for red, orange, yellow, green, blue, dark blue, purple. You can choose whatever colours you like, it's your picture. Stick to a traditional rainbow if you want. We're going brown for the hills. That's it. Lovely. One more to go. Going around the house. Done. Green tree. It's summertime, you know. Going around those fruits very carefully. We don't want to colour those in green. That's it. You're doing a great job. Well, I would love to live in a house like this, wouldn't you? With a rainbow and the sun is shining and there's a river. I've got my very own boat. Red fruit. What do you think it could be? Apples? Fantastic. A brown tree trunk. Let's go for a lighter green for the grass behind the river. That's a great contrast to the brown mountains. We've got lots of brown and green. Going around the house. Lovely. Wow, what a beautiful garden. Let's do around the tree as well on the other side of the river. Let's paint the house. A yellow chimney top, yellow walls. Lovely. Hmm, let's go for red tiles. Excellent. And the edges can be blue, blue windows, and a pink chimney and door. Perfect. How about some yellow and pink for our boat? Blue for our river. Wow, that's lovely. It's a darker blue than the sky. Somewhere over the rainbow, way up high. There's a land that I've heard of once in a lullaby. It is absolutely beautiful. Maybe you'd find it at the end of a rainbow. <laughs> Dark green for our tufts of grass, just like the tree. And there you have it. Perfect scenery. Hi friends, look at my gorgeous house. Let's draw. We'll start with a triangle for the roof. It's going to be a wide triangle. Now, slightly inside the edge of the triangle, we're doing a rectangle underneath. And a tall rectangular door with a circular door handle and square windows with crisscross frames. And now, let's do something in the garden. We're doing a gorgeous tree. A rectangle and a cone shape for the tree. A circle with small triangles on the outside for the sun. Look at those rays. There you go. That was so easy. Time to paint. Green first for our lovely tree. So you see, it just takes a few different shapes. You put them all together and you get a fabulous picture. You could draw your house taller, thinner, more windows, more doors, whatever you like. 
round for the tree trunk. What things do you have in your garden? Maybe some flowers and grass. We're doing a red roof. Wow, I would love a red sparkly roof on my house, wouldn't you? Almost there. Done. Now yellow. The main body of our house is going to be sparkly yellow. If you wanted, you could do patterns on your walls, like stripes or zigzags or even swirly-whirly patterns. Perhaps you could have some flowers growing up the side of your house. Maybe you could even draw bricks and make them multicoloured. There! Now for pink! Lovely pink window frames, but only every other one. Next we're going for blue, which we're going to alternate with the pink. Blue and pink look fantastic, don't you think? Purple now for the door! Wow, my favourite colour! Going around the door handle, side to side and done! Door handle can be green! Yes, and last but not least, a golden sun! Golden rays all around! Wonderful! and yellow for the main part. Wow, this looks amazing! And can you believe how easy it was to do? Brilliant! There you have it! Home sweet home!